CNN's Cape file found that Monica Crowley, who was recently picked to be part of President-elect Donald Trump's national security team, plagiarized large sections of a book she wrote in 2012. For the review, there are at least 50 examples found of Crowley plagiarizing sources for her book What the, Flea, Just Happened, leaning on articles, Wikipedia, and think tanks, among others. It was pointed out that the book does not contain a bibliography, footnotes, or attribution. Crowley was recently tapped by the incoming Trump administration to be the senior director of strategic communications for the National Security Council. Prior to getting the job, she was a Fox News contributor and conservative radio host. K-File presented various side-by-side -side examples of the plagiarism, such as this. It was shown that she lifted portions of columns and articles written by well-known conservative voices like Andrew McCarthy, Michelle Malkin, Rich Lowry, and Karl Rove. She also copied work from the Associated Press, Politico, and the New York Times. In response to the report, the Trump transition team blamed it on politics and indicated it would stand by Crowley. Monica's exceptional insight and thoughtful work on how to turn this country around is exactly why she will be serving in the administration, a statement from a transition spokesperson said. HarperCollins one of the largest and most respected publishers in the world published her book which has become a national bestseller. Any attempt to discredit Monica is nothing more than a politically motivated attack that seeks to distract from the real issues facing this country. Interestingly, this isn't the first time Crowley's been accused of plagiarism. In the late 90s, it was reported that she pretty much copied a 1988 piece by commentary for a column she wrote for the Wall Street Journal.